Okay, let's start. First, I'd like to introduce the motivation of our work. Diagnosis prediction utilizing electronic health records has become a pivotal area within AI-driven healthcare applications. Many studies leverage deep learning techniques to model dynamic hospital visits, thereby facilitating clinical decision support. However, a challenge arises as most disease progressions and changes in patient health are inherently continuous, while clinical records are discrete due to irregular patient visits. To alleviate the challenges posted by irregular time steps, some studies have adopted neural ordinary differential equations, offering a more comprehensive understanding of continuous time disease progression and enhancing progressive diagnostic prediction. However, existing studies usually assume a predefined prior for the patient, for example, Gaussian, which might result in the inferred approximation approximate posterior greatly deviating from the real-world distribution. Therefore, it is important to devise an ideal model to effectively capture a more accurate posterior approximation of the patient distributions, as well as the continuity underlying disease progression. However, there are two challenges. How to continuously model disease progression under discrete patient irregular visits, and how to close the gap between approximate posterior and the real posterior solely based on the patient's historical visits. To address these challenges, we propose ProCNF. In this work, we propose a novel ProCNF framework aimed at enhancing progressive diagnosis prediction in healthcare with continuous normalizing flows. Specifically, we first leverage CNF to transform a patient from a simple base distribution, for example, Gaussian, into a more complex patient-specific distribution via a series of invertible mappings when the base distribution is reparameterizable. Then based on the complex patient distributions, we propose a CNF-enhanced neural ODEs module to diagnostic prediction. Firstly, given the multi-hot diagnosis vector, we pick out the corresponding diagnosis embeddings and sum them up to get visit embedding by factor matrix dot product. Then we aggregate patients' historical visit embeddings through a self-attention mechanism. In this way, we can apply the widely adopted reparameterization trick for sampling a latent initial state, where we utilize MLP as an encoder. With the initial state CI0, we then apply a differential function beta, which enables the transformation of the initial Gaussian distribution into a more complex patient-specific distribution. In this way, we can reduce the gap between approximate posterior and true posterior by employing such richer prior distribution. Finally, we have the evidence lower bound objective based on CNF. With the learned sophisticated patient embeddings, we further define CNF-enhanced neural ODEs for progressive diagnostic prediction so as to model continuous patient status over time. In this way, the patient status representation can be inferred by solving the neural ODEs. Since um, personalized diagnosis prediction is a multi-label classification task, we use a dense level with a soft matrix function to calculate the, the predicted probability. Specifically, we fully leverage the historical visits to serve as supervision. The predicted visits are based on the inferred patient status, and we can compute the predictive objective function. Then let's see some experimental results. 
We use two real-world datasets to verify the effectiveness of our framework. That is Mimic3 and NAIL. NAIL is a large-scale real-world clinical data collected by the NAIL Hodgson Wardrobe School of Nursing at Emory University. Um, both datasets are fully anonymized and carefully sanitized before our access. We choose patients who made at least three visits for both datasets, and we use recall and NDCG metrics. In general, the proposed ProCNF outperforms all nine baselines across all the metrics. Um, compared with the second best model, that is LH LHM, the performance gains of ProCNF ranges from 2.0% with NDCG at 5 on Mimic 3 and 2 9.3% achieved with Recall at 10 on Mimic 3. Although LHM adopts neural ODEs for continuous disease progression, it fails to capture complex distributions behind patients. Uh, we also provide uh, the predictive diagnosis of one example patient. The analysis of the disease progression from the diabetic patient showcases the strength of ProCNF. For instance, ProCNF successfully predicts the recurrence of um, atrial fibrillation and other and unspecified hyperlipidemia for visit K plus 2 and K plus 1 rep respectively. Despite this diagnosis not being recorded in the preceding visits, this reflects our method's capability to understand and predict the ongoing nature of chronic conditions, ensuring a comprehensive and consistent monitoring of the patient health status. Uh, finally, let's see some conclusions. Here is the main contribution of our work. In this paper, we propose to make progressive diagnosis prediction for patient visits with irregular intervals in healthcare. Specifically, we propose a novel progressive diagnostic prediction model, um, ProCNF, with two pivotal techniques, which jointly perform complex patient distributions and dynamic disease progression to achieve a more accurate approximation of patient health trajectories. Extensive experiments demonstrate the clear advantages of our model over state-of-the-art baselines, which is further consolidated with our real case study. Uh, in the future, it will be interesting to consider the incorporation of explicit disease per properties as well as other diagnosis-related factors, such as um, past procedures and medications from the rich EHR date. Moreover, the ProCNF model can be further investigated and utilized to support various important clinical tasks, such as early risk prediction and treatment effort prediction for, uh, for specific diseases. Thanks for your listening.